Assalamualaikum. I am Dr. Varis. Welcome you all in healthcare with Dr. Varis. Today topic which is chosen for you is malaria, very common, is caused by a female Anopheles mosquito which is pregnant too, which when it bites it causes fever and the classical picture of that fever is chills, rigors, fevers and, and fever and then sweating. It's a very classical picture of that malaria. There are uh, five types of uh, plasmodium that can cause malaria. In Pakistan, we have uh, only two uh, plasmodiums, that is uh, plasmodium falciparum and plasmodium vivax, which causes uh, fever of malaria in, in Pakistan. But uh, there are other three, the plasmodium malaria, plasmodium ovale and plasmodium olvesi, which uh, are not here in, in Pakistan. And the picture uh, when the patient comes with us uh, a fever and that fever has had, had not uh, been to that patient immediately after the bite but after a few time, days of bite it is, appears uh, fever and rigors and chills uh, that is uh, called incubation period and incubation period uh, for plasmodium vivax uh, is uh, as 12 to 17 days and for falciparum it is 9 to 12 days and or 14 days and that is then called incubation period. So uh, first of all we will talk uh, about the treatment phase of uh, uh, the plasmodium vivax. Before starting treatment we have to must diagnose perfectly the, which parasite has caused this uh, uh, malaria. Uh, when uh, it is uh, caused by uh, plasmodium vivax, uh, it is diagnosed on uh, uh, microscopy and RDT kits, uh, rapid diagnostic test kits and our microscopy is the also best way. The benefit of uh, RDT, availability of RDT kit over microscopy is that it very easily available uh, rapidly diagnosis uh, and uh, when uh, microscopy is not available when low paracetamol in blood uh, when patient has also taken some drugs uh, in these all conditions uh, on RDT kit uh, malaria will appear and in the patient we can diagnose as that uh, patient has malaria. So when it is clear that a patient has plasmodium vivax malaria, then it is best drug for that is the chloroquine and with permaquine for 14 days. And when it is plasmodium falciparum, then we use artisunate's combination therapy ACT, that's artimether, and romifentrin and so many drugs. Here we cannot describe the exact figure and the exact schedule of these drugs, but we will also inform you that these are the drugs. And in pregnancy, in the chloroquine is very safe drug in the first trimester and throughout pregnancy also. But when it fails and cannot control, then we can use quinine and tablets and injection form also in pregnancy. And quinine is also safe in pregnancy. And there is also misconception that it can get abortion through quinine, but it is not true. How will prevent from malaria and and by mosquitoes by it is by using insecticide nets and use of DDT powders and not to stay stagnant water around surrounding us and then we will keep safe ourselves and then it is all about this malaria. Kindly keep yourself safe. Allah Hafiz.